there is something going on in our schools, according to this, something called furry. And I think it's spelled F-U-R-R-Y. I looked it up on Google here. Oh, I got I to gotta get back into my computer. Um, it's described to me that we have kids in our schools that believe that they are animals. And they are identifying, I'm told, as animals. Identifying as animals. They think they're a cat. A cat. They put tails on and they demand that they have a litter box in the school. Has anybody else heard that? Have you heard about this furry thing and what? I mean, your district and mine are a long ways away, but I've talked to others here. Tell us what you know about this. I've got the dictionary. It's, it's in the dictionary on Google, Madam Speaker. When I heard about this, I heard that they were actually cutting holes in the uniforms for tails. Uh, and then put, in some cases, the students were putting on uh, fake tails. And in some cases, uh, one of the parents in, in, was uh, responding to what was happening in the school where a child that believed themselves to be a cat didn't have a physical tail, but had an imaginary tail. And they were sitting at, a, I think it was a lunch, uh, 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 the table in the lunchroom, and this imaginary tail was there, and a student came up and sat down, and the, the child that believed themselves to be a cat screamed, you just sat on my tail. That was imaginary, it didn't exist. In my district, and I won't even name the school, I will say in my district, I had a pastor come to me, and he said, he is being told that in the one school district, and I'm not saying this is the case, we don't know, it's unconfirmed, but he is being told by multiple people that there's a, there's a litter box in one of the locker rooms, is that that's my, or a bathroom, that's my understanding.